Daily SDRT. Subscribe now. Oh, subscribe now. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, we'll be talking about JD Youngin. So as you guys probably should have heard by now, RIP to JD Youngin. For the people that don't know, a couple days ago, like two days ago, him and his dad ended up getting shot together. And Jay ended up passing away from the injuries he sustained. So RIP to him, but there's more evidence coming out, coming out about what happened, stuff like that. And it's being reported how Jay's people, they try to like spin on the ops the same day that the Jay situation happened. So I got a little reading for y'all right here, but it goes, Jay Youngin's grandfather says he heard that the person who shot him came from behind his mother's house. And then this is what the police had to say. Police also say Jay Youngin's people retaliated on the same day after the incident. So what are y'all thoughts on that? Comment down below. Jay Young, J.D. Youngin was shot. And then immediately is being said how the same day his people tried to get get back on the same people that shot Jay. How are you guys feeling about that? Comment down below. As you guys can see right here on the screen, it's being reported how there was also a shooting outside of the hospital where Jay was at. And there was also another shooting at, some, at somebody's crib. At, in, the, in like the same town, but in these two shootings, the one at the hospital, the one at the crib, nobody was injured, but how are you guys feeling about that? J.D. Youngin's people immediately try to spin back on the ops, try to retaliate, but nobody was hurt, but how are you guys feeling? Let me know down below in the comments, but yeah, that's it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Thanks for watching.